CBS The Bold and the Beautiful spoilers tease that Carter and Quinn couldn't seem to leave each other. No one can separate their love. B&B spoilers teases that the couple's relationship can come to an end, and both will pay the price for their love story. However, they will not escape the Forster family's life quietly. Because before everything is really over, the quarter will have to go through many other ups and downs. Sooner or later, Eric learns that Quinn is Carter's apartment, and he will go on a rampage and act out of control. Meanwhile, Quinn holds a 10% stake in Forrester. Obviously, we all know what Carter does. Unlike his true self, perhaps it is love that makes people blind, unable to distinguish right from wrong. Carter has always been known as a talented, kind person, but now good things are no longer mentioned when it comes to him. Instead, he often sneaks up on embarrassing things. It gets a little bad, and we hope that soon Carter can overcome life's pitfalls and get back to being himself. B&B spoilers suggest that a similar act could happen in another dramatic story. It doesn't need to be hidden. Brooke is planning her own future by replacing Steffi as co-CEO and taking it as a source of pride after so many years of nothing tell. As we can see now, Brooke has successfully raised the backing of Ridge and Eric, who jointly hold a 57.5% stake, more than enough to have the right to vote on the appointment on the position Brooke is seeking. Being Beast Boys teased that it could be bad news that Steffi was about to hear. Everything seemed to fall apart before her eyes. If that really happens, what will Steffi do to regain her place? But wait, that's not all. Let's not forget that Quinn is holding a 10% stake from Eric. This means that total shares of Ridge and Eric combined are only 47.5%. Meanwhile, Steffi will also call for support from other shareholders. Quinn and Steffi both dislike Brooke, and it's clear that of her lack of ability is something that no one would dare to hand over a key position of the company to someone with such lack of expertise. Besides, it was Thomas who staunchly opposed this, so the three of them could ally with each other. With 37.5% of Steffi's Quinn, 10%, and Thomas's 5%, now the victory is definitely on them. Don't get cocky, Brooke. What we speculate is quite possible, because Quinn and Thomas, a powerful member of Forster, are ready to fight, and they will win. Brooke will be embarrassed for having a celebration too soon. Forrester's men will also pay a price when they can overcome Steffi. Believe that these mythical speculations can completely turn into reality? Thanks to Quinn's contribution, she can now become Steffi's good friend. A lousy job at Forrester, a romance with Carter, and watching her number one enemy experience a sense of failure. That's exactly what Quinn is seeing.